Hello everyone and welcome to the DPB Podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Mondes. This is episode number 254 for July 26th, 2022. Welcome to the Disney Pins Blog Podcast, the latest news on Disney pin trading and collecting from around the world. Welcome back to the show, everyone. It's been almost two months since I had a podcast episode go up, but it feels great to be back. For today's episode, I'm just going to cover a little bit of box lunch releases and some of the most recent Disney Parks releases. Uh, but first, before we get into that, we'll start off with housekeeping. Just want to mention that our July giveaway is now live. At the time of this recording, there's about three days remaining. So head over to DisneyPinsBulb.com slash giveaways for your chance to win the Tiana Epcot Food and Wine Festival pin. All right, and now for the pin news. First, we're gonna start off with box lunch. And they had a bunch of new Halloween 2022 pin releases. These are actually available via pre-order. They're expected to ship, I believe, late August or early uh, September. First one is a Mickey Mouse Jack-O-Lantern pin, glow in the dark with PVC elements. Then there is a Minnie Mouse as a cat, Daisy Duck as a witch, Goofy as Frankenstein, Stitch as a vampire, and Stitch as a mummy. Then there was also a Disney Characters as Pumpkins blind box pin set by Loungefly. Eight different pins in this collection. One randomly selected per box with a retail price of $10.90. Box Lunch also had another blind box pin set. This one's called Disney Princess Sidekicks and Desserts. Features six different pins in total. You have Flounder, Pascal, Abu, the uh, Bears from Merida, Pua and Gus from Cinderella. Retail price for that set is $9.90 per pin. And then finally at Box Lunch, there was a new series featuring characters as constellations in the night sky. They feature the Aristocats, Winnie the Pooh, Tiana from Princess and the Frog, Aurora from Sleeping Beauty, and Alice from Alice in Wonderland. Next, we're gonna head over to DPB Store because we actually had some new Loungefly releases. First up, there was a Princess floral tattoo lanyard pin set. If you guys recall, there was also a floral tattoo blind box pin set, uh, but this one comes with a lanyard. Four different princesses on a lanyard, very nice print. Characters include Belle, Aurora, Pocahontas, and Mulan. Retail price for that is $25, and we still have a few left at DPB store. Then there was also a new Stitch and Angel blind box pin set. We also have this one available at DVD store, but the chaser, I think we only have one left at the time of this recording. Also want to mention to the podcast watchers and listeners that we will have another DPB exclusive pin release this week on Thursday. So keep an eye out for that. I'll give you guys a hint. It features Alice in Wonderland. And it's also limited edition of 500. Next up is Shop Disney, and they had two new D23 exclusive pin releases featuring Hercules' 25th anniversary. The first one is actually a box pin set featuring the muses from Hercules. It's a limited edition of 1000 retail price $79.99. And then there was just a single pin featuring Hercules, and this one is limited edition of 1500 retail price $14.99. Those released on Monday, July 25th at shopdisney.com. All right, and now Disney Parks in America. There have actually been a lot of new open edition pin releases, so we'll go over those now. First up, there's a new line of Marvel character pins. These have a retail price of $10. They feature Spider-Man, Captain America, Doctor Strange, Iron Man, Loki, Rocket and Groot, Black Panther, Captain Marvel, Sharpshooter, and Ant-Man. I spy those at Epcot, but they'll be available on both coasts. Next, we saw new pin releases for Toy Story Land at Disney's Hollywood Studios. I uh, spotted these at Disney's Pin Traders down at Disney Springs. Four new pins, one featuring Woody and the Toy Story Land sign. That one's $12.99. Uh, the next one is Alien with the uh, Toy Story Land claw. Then there was a Slinky Dog Dash pin, $12.99 on that one. And then the Army Men. It reads, Sarge says, let's play. And this is $9.99. Nice to see new pin releases for Toy Story Land. Next up, there were a few new Haunted Mansion pin releases, and these have been pretty popular at the parks. 
First, there is a mystery pin set. It depicts ghost portraits. I really love this set. I was only able to buy two boxes so far. Um, everywhere I went, they are selling out quickly. But I would like to complete this entire set. And they're bigger pins in person. It looks like they glow in the dark. I'm not 100% sure if they do or not. But yeah, beautiful designs. Um, it's open edition, retail price $17.99. Uh, per box of two pins. Then there are new Haunted Mansion single pins. Also spotted these at Disney Springs and Epcot. There's a Haunted Mansion logo pin, $9.99. Foolish Mortals pin, also $10. Uh, one featuring the bride, it reads, I'm a heartbreaker. That one is $12.99 because it has a uh, pin on pin design. Then there's a hat box ghost pin. This one is $9.99. And then finally, there is a framed Madame Leota pin, and this one is $12.99. Next at Disney Parks is a new Cats and Dogs Autumn Leaves Mystery Pin Collection. This one actually just released today on July 26, 2022 at Walt Disney World. There are 10 different pins in total. It's actually a limited release collection. Retail price is $24.99 per box of two pins. And the characters include Lucky, Marie, Figaro, Bruno, Simba, Copper, Todd, Stitch, Pluto, and Nana. All of them are playing in a pal of autumn leaves. Then the next Tiny Kingdom pin set released. It's, uh, so far it's only at Disneyland, but we'll be coming to Walt Disney World as well. This is the third edition, Series 3. Also released on Tuesday, July 26th. Three randomly selected pins per box. That's a limited release collection. Lots of pins in this collection. There are 24 in total. And then finally, for the new limited edition pin releases this week at Disney Parks, they were a continuation of the Pinball Machine series, Disney Arcade. Walt Disney World received a pinball machine themed to A Bug's Life. And then Disneyland received one featuring Wall-E. Both of those are a limited edition of 1500 Retail price, $19.99 each. All right, guys, well, that's going to do it for the July 2022 Week 4 Disney Pin News. You can find all of the releases on our website, DisneyPinsBlog.com. And uh, in case you guys missed it, I uh, did put a video up on our YouTube channel featuring the One Family Pin releases for the upcoming event here in August. All right, thank you for listening or watching episode number 254 of the DVD Podcast. Hope you guys have a great week. See ya.